Hello everyone, Sarcasm here, and it's time for another episode of Snack React. Today, uh, uh okay, I, I keep pushing back some of the things I'm supposed to be recording, because I keep finding new things. But, yeah, I was checking out Safeway the other day, and, uh, yeah, it turns out they have a couple new, uh, I guess, limited times Pepsi flavors. And, uh, yeah. Uh, Sorry to see her check something. Okay. But yeah, so I picked those up and I picked up a snack to go with it. And yeah, that's what I'll be looking at today. So to start things off, I have Vortman Bakery Apple Crisp Wafers. Yep, baked with real apples, no artificial colors or flavors, no high fructose corn syrup, limited edition. Yeah, they also had a pumpkin spice one, but like I thought, yeah, if I do do that one, and it would be for like uh, a, uh, I don't know, I want to say Halloween, but that's more of an autumn thing, though. Yeah, whatever. I'll, I'll give it some thought. Like I have, as I'm recording this, I have about a month until Halloween anyway, so I have time to think about it. So yeah, um, yeah. Let's get this open. This is a, this is actually a pretty big package, and it was fairly affordable. I think I paid like two fifty for this. Don't quote me on that, but uh, yeah, I think there was a sale going on. There we go. Ooh, nice strong apple scent. Very nice. Now, if I can get one out, nice little wafer snack. And hey, it was baked with real apples, so that's a good sign. Also, I believe I'm getting a hint of cinnamon. So, uh, yeah. Hmm. Got your standard nice crisp wafer, you know, texture. Sorry, something flew into the keyboard. But yeah, and the flavor. Honestly, I think it's uh, a bit better than the usual wafer snacks I've tried. Like the uh, apple flavor is very nice. What the? Oh. They were stuck together. <laughs> Yeah, like a nice juicy red apple. Of course, with hints of cinnamon. Hmm. Yeah, that's very nice. Although, now that I've stopped the eating them, there's a little bit of an... Um, Okay, it's more of an apple-ish aftertaste, but there's still a bit of an aftertaste there. That's going to cleanse the palate there. And next up, I have Pepsi Cola Soda Shop Black Cherry Cola. So yeah, a uh, Black Cherry Pepsi. Or, yeah, Black Cherry Cola. From Pepsi. Made with real sugar, so okay, that's nice. Okay. Okay, looking at it, it has a slightly reddish tint to it. What is to be expected? It is black cherry after all. Ooh, that is that is a strong sweet smell. 
Yeah, that that is, that is black cherry. That that that's nice. So, how does the flavor stack up against you know everything else? That's weird. It has like a strange texture to it. Like it uh, start, starts out like your standard cola, but then quickly ends up being kind of like a uh, Kind of a syrupy, not like heavy syrupy, but like uh, light syrupy. Hmm. As for the flavor, I don't know. Like, um, I've definitely had def I've definitely had better black cherry sodas. This one just tastes kind of weird. Like you know what it is? So I was reminded of those uh <clears throat> hold on a second. Okay, I'm back. Um, but yeah, it reminds me of those uh, soda machines. Not like the standard ones, but like the choose your own flavor soda machines. And those always taste kind of like have a weird syrupy flavor to it. That That's kind of what I'm getting from this one. And uh, yeah, I, honestly, I don't really like it. Uh, not It's not for me. Anyway, I have one more thing to check out, but yeah, I need to take care of some stuff, so I'll be right back after this quick cut. And finally, I have Pepsi Soda Shop Cream Soda Cola. Uh, yeah, th with this one, I'm a bit wary because, yeah, the black cherry wasn't that great, and I realized that, uh, I'm not sure on this, but if Soda Shop is there, is the Pepsi version of the, uh, Coke freestyle machine that would explain the syrupy taste. Cause uh yeah. So anyway. <clears throat> uh yeah, I guess it's time to try this out. Hopefully this one's a bit better. Huh. Okay, it does have, it smells so much of the black cherry, but I can definitely tell that it's a cream soda. Like the smell, the smell is, is like, I've smelled cream soda before. It's like, that's about what it smells like. So at least the smell's on point. Um, uh, here we go. No, <laughs> just doesn't even really taste like cream soda. It like it tastes like something, but it's like there's also this weird, really sweet but kind of fake tasting aftertaste, and. uh Yeah, usually I'm all for new Pepsi flavors. Uh, okay, usually I'm more for m new Mountain Dew flavors, but, you know, Pepsi, Mountain Dew, whatever. But, uh, yeah, I think I can call this this uh, new set 
an absolute failure. <sighs> like, it, it, it just does not taste pleasant at all. And I mean, I'll finish it up because I hate wasting stuff, but I won't enjoy it. Uh, well, I guess it's time for the ratings. For the Apple Crisp wafers, I'm giving those a 7 out of 10. Pretty good, nice apple flavor. A bit messy, but, uh, you know, it's a wafer snack. That's that's usually to be expected. For the... Okay, for both the... Uh, okay, so yeah, for the uh, Black Cherry Cola, 4 out of 10. It... <sighs> No. It just tastes syrupy, it tastes weird, and just, it's not a pleasant feeling, you know? And for the cream soda cola, also a 4 out of 10. Yeah, same thing, like, just doesn't even taste like cream soda. And the reason why it's only a 4 is... I can finish it, I just won't like it. If if it gets slower, I might consider just tossing it. But, uh, yeah. This wasn't really a pleasant episode. I mean, aside from the, uh, wafers, those were, those were pretty good. But, yeah, this was a bit disappointing. Anyway, um... Yeah, that's it. That's that'll be it for this week's episode. I hope you all enjoyed. If you have any suggestions for things for me to try out, please let me know in the comments section below. And until next time, have a good week and take care. See you later.